Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a bunch of leaks to look at, so let's get into the video. Alright, so first of all, Treasure Track has not come yet. Uh, it's been two days since it was removed. It has not come back. Uh, I don't know why. There was nothing added in for it in the CDN today. Hopefully there's something tomorrow, but now we are going to go ahead and look at a bunch of stuff. We have um, the member jar stuff to look at. Uh, I mentioned that in a previous video. Uh, we have charged levels, and then something that I'm not 100% sure what it is, but uh, let's just get into the leaks. Alright, so here is the first leak. This is called spine charge level pet book so this is going to be the charge for inside of the pet book which means we are going to see it inside of the pet book this one is called spine charge visual and as we can see right here it says charge kept charge lost so you can lose your charge i'm pretty sure there's something about it later that will make it a little clearer on when you can lose it and when you can keep it so uh, this is the next one it's called spine charged in battle visual uh so i guess it's gonna like show that your level is charged when you're on the or like when you're inside a battle there's also another thing I forgot to mention, and this is actually in-game. It got added today, I believe. And it says max level. So it says that level 100 is the max level. Um, as far as I know, charged levels have not been added. I haven't seen anyone that has charged levels. Of course, everyone here also doesn't have the capacity to be on level 100. And yeah, I'd also get mail about it which there is none so it's definitely not in the game but we're gonna continue looking at the leaks so i think we're probably here yeah spine charged level bar so there's a ton of stuff here don't know what any of it means like maybe this is just you leveling up i don't know then we go to this one which is called spine item card bfx I have no idea what this one is supposed to be. It says item card. Um, maybe they're talking about, if we go into our backpack, maybe they're just talking about these item cards. Is there going to be something with charged levels that makes our armor better or something? I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. This is the one we just looked at. So we have this one, which is called UI Charged Levels. So we can see right here we have a yellow circle with, uh, I can't remember, Wick and uh, Ruckus, I think. Um, we have these swords. We have just the plain circle here. We have a calendar. We have an arrow. And we have... Uh, this gold right here. So maybe what the gold is meaning is that we are going to be able to use gold to get extra levels. And then what this calendar means, I think, is that each day that you log in, uh, your uh, charge will rather go up or you just maintain it and you can't go up levels or something. Well, I guess like you'd log in every day and then the levels that you bought will be maintained. So this next one, I'm pretty sure I showed last uh, video about uh, the charged levels, is charged levels burst background. They just changed the name for it. I'm pretty sure this is still something that I showed. Then we just have the plain yellow circle. This one is called charged levels glow ring. So I assume this is going to going to be around you when you're leveling up. Then we have charged levels retention background, which I showed last video also, but they just updated it. I have no idea what they updated with it. 
Then we have export test calendar, which don't know why they called it export test, but this is the calendar to like maintain your streak or something. Then this one is called icon arrow curved. We saw this in the UI. Then we move on to this one, which is icon battle swords. I don't know what the swords are supposed to mean. I forgot to mention that in the UI. I have no idea what the swords are supposed to mean. Maybe this means that you are going to be only able to battle charged leveled people when you're in the arena. Or in the dual stadium, which could be good. And then we have this one, which is just called Icon Charged Levels Team. So, uh, I don't really know what this one's supposed to be. Actually, one of the things that I do notice is that they have an up arrow on the wand or power, uh, hearts, and defense. So, your level might not be the only thing affected by this. Your hearts and stuff also might be affected by this as well. Then we have this gold, which I showed in the other one. I don't know what it's supposed to- oh wait, yeah, I do know what it's supposed to mean. I kind of set a theory on it. I don't know why it got updated, because it's the exact same thing as it was last time. Alright, so I was actually just looking in the metadata, and I found something about charged levels. So, let's go ahead and look at that. So, you're here in the, um, metadata, and we can see, um, charged levels, where is the next line? Here it is. Charged levels release. Introducing charged levels. Starting at level 100, your wizard can power up even more with special charged levels. Play every four days to keep the charge going. And then we have a bunch of stuff that no one cares about. Yeah, I have no idea what it even means. Um, charged levels release. Um, this stuff doesn't really give us anything about when charged levels are going to be released, because there's no reliable dates in it. But we do have more stuff to look at, so I'm just going to go down a little more, and here's the next one. Oh wait, this stuff doesn't matter. Yeah, those were just, like, description of pets, but yeah, there's nothing else in here. I tried to look for a date, it doesn't look like there's anything that would help with that. And now we are moving on to the member jar stuff. This is getting an update, and here's what we've got. So we have this stuff up here, this stuff, none of it's really important. We've pretty much already seen it in another video that I made. But basically this is like a gift, these are stars, these are coins, and then I have no idea what these uh, like blue vases are. Then we have UI member jar, which they just removed some stuff from the UI that I showed last video on this topic. And then this one is actually interesting because you can like, there's a full image. This kind of looks like a wizard watch post, but I don't think it's supposed to be because it's called Prompts Member Jar. So I think this is going to come up whenever you try and open the member jar, but you're not a member. So it's going to tell you to buy membership. Then we have Icon Member Jar Stamp Red. This is just part of the UI. Don't know what it's supposed to mean. Oh, wait, it's probably going to mean that you have whatever amount of days left to open the jar or this stuff is going to disappear. Then we have jar is full, which is pretty explan explanatory. Um, this is an empty jar. Here's a full jar. Here's uh, a half full jar. It doesn't look half full. It looks more than half full. Uh, we have a, a small amount in the jar. Um, and then I don't know what this is supposed to be. It's supposed to be a sparkle. I have no idea if you can see it because it's white on, like, not tan, sort of like a gray. So you might be able to see it, you might not. Um, then we have a bunch of icons here. In the top left, we have a hammer. And then we have a check, um, a present, a plus, a left arrow, a right arrow, a down arrow an X, a lock, uh, 
a musical note, a play button, that's what it's called on the CD, and I chose not to show them. Because there is something for every single one of these, but since they're all here, I chose not to show them. Then we have this shopping cart, uh, the sparkles, which means that... Oh wait, no, that's different. But then we have this, like, sort of reload button, and then this up button. And then these things, I don't really know what they're supposed to mean. It says Emerald Large Default. These kind of look like buttons, and the thing that I thought when I saw them is when we go into here, we can see that when we go to, war not awards, badges, we have stone. There is a stone one. There's amber, which there's not an amber. Garnet, no. Emerald, there is. Ruby, there is. Topaz, there is not. Amethyst, I don't think so. Diamond, there's not. So yeah, um, that theory, or what I thought was, uh, pretty wrong. That's not the right one. Uh, I think we're, no, we're not, yeah, we're at emerald. So then there's a gold, there's a marble, uh, ruby, sapphire, stone. Oh yeah, and then here we go, we are moving into a different sort of leak this is um the data this is like um dialogue and stuff like that and i'm actually going to use a difference checker to look at this because it makes finding stuff a lot easier as we can see right here it says member jar base rewards free so they're going to be free rewards then we have member jar member rewards member rewards uh member jar counts, uh, insert number here, items, and then this parent goal stuff, doesn't matter. We go down, charged levels, X levels lost, so you can lose a certain amount of levels. You lost zero charged levels, charged levels, lose my charge. So, I think that was already in that part last time, but, oh wait, I don't think any of this stuff was actually added. But yeah, basically what it does mean, I'll just say it since I was already talking about it, um, you can lose a certain amount of levels for, uh, like not logging in for a certain amount of days or something. Then we go here, there is a ton of stuff to look at in here. Streak, uh, member jar count, stars, zero stars, or insert number here, stars. Member, member jar count gold insert number here gold member jar count zone currencies that would be like florins and stuff like that so i guess that's what the uh blue vase i was talking about looks there is supposed to be then we have a member jar count and that's member jar counts other uh plus zero more items so you can finally get items from doing uh battles again is what it's going to sound like but you have to be a member so then it says member jar open jar get all rewards maxed level max level member jar rewards uh rewards level up level up uh charge up charge up these are stuff to do with uh charge levels let me move back to member jar member jar add count stars zero stars member jar add count items not sure what the at- Oh, I know what this is supposed to be. Uh, text will show up next to these to show how much of each thing you have, I assume. So, we're like right here now, max charge, max charge, so you- I think this is for member jars, maybe it's for charge levels, but you can reach a max- max charge, I guess. Then it says member jar full, member jar charge full, member jar full. And then we move into stuff with, um, Stadium Rooms, which was found by me on Monday. So it says, Stadium Room, Ineligible Reason Title Level Lock, Room Locked, Stadium Room, inel Ineligible Reason Body Level Lock, Come Back Once You Reach Level Zero. So, you're gonna have to be at a certain level to unlock these rooms. 
then it says stadium room ineligible recent title no tickets i have no idea what tickets are supposed to do and hopefully they don't add this you shouldn't have to have a certain amount of something to be able to battle this you should just be able to battle whenever you want um stadium's room ineligible title entry cost not enough gold if they're going to make us pay gold to play in the dual stadium that's stupid hopefully this is just for some like ranked thing that they're gonna add stadium room ineligible reason body entry cost come back when you have um insert numbers stadium room ineligible reason title membership become a member so you might have to become a member to be able to unlock some of the rooms. Stadium room ineligible reason body membership. Become a member to continue. Stadium room ineligible reason title time of day closed. So you might not be able to play at some time of the day because it's only open from like one time to another time. Open from 0 to 1, so like open from one time to another time. Stadium room, ineligible reason, title, fallback, unavailable. So there might be some rooms or something, some room in the arena that's, or in the dual stadium that's unavailable because, I don't know. Stadium room, ineligible, body, fallback, currently unavailable, come back later. Member Jar will lose rewards. These rewards will be lost for 80... What? Will be lost forever. Stadium Room Find Match Find Match. Now, there is one other thing that I'm gonna check. Um, it's gonna take a while. So, sorry if this video comes out really late. Just kidding. Um, it crashed. The, I was gonna use another another difference checker but it crashed and then the other one i use um it was just way too laggy so it didn't work so not gonna try but yeah that is going to go ahead and end up the video if you enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe and bye